Quickshot is a very handy app that lets you create unlimited shortcuts and up to 15 quick setting tiles for pretty much anything from apps and individual app activities to files, websites and device settings. You can also customize the shortcuts with different icons, backgrounds and stuff. In addition, you can group your shortcuts and access them all at a time with a single shortcut. I like the clean interface and how simple the app is to use. This one is a super useful location sharing app that focuses on privacy and security. Using the app, you can share your real-time location with your friends and family using end-to-end -end encryption without creating any account. Simply generate a unique code and send it to anyone you want to share your location with. You can also create multiple groups, share different locations and even get notified when someone arrives or leaves a certain spot. So if you're looking for a private, reliable way to share your location, Paralino is a must try. If you were a fan of that nothing OS aesthetic, you're gonna love Noid. It's a simple stylish file manager designed with that clean minimal look. The interface is super intuitive with different types of files neatly categorized for quick access. Honestly, it's one of the better looking file managers out there, so make sure to check it out. Next on the list is Octopi Launcher, a fresh alternative to popular Android launchers. It's feature-rich, productivity-focused with a modern design offering everything you'd expect. Widget support, gestures, icon pack support, custom pages, you name it. The launcher looks good enough on regular phones but really shines on foldables. So if you're on the hunt for a new Android launcher, give this one a go. Remind Me is an amazing reminder app that doesn't just send you a notification. Instead, it calls you. You record a voice note, set the time and when it's time, the app kinda calls you and plays your own voice telling you what to do. It's super effective and way harder to ignore than regular buzz. If you're an anime fan, you've got to try Animop. It's super easy to use. Just click and watch. You can also manually search for your favorite shows and enjoy them in multiple languages, qualities and subtitles. It's simple, clean and gets the job done. So if you love anime, don't sleep on this one. Moving on, we have Orb, a sleek network performance app from the creators of Speedtest and Down Detector. It constantly monitors your internet across devices and networks giving you real-time insights into responsiveness, reliability, and speed. All the data is then rolled into a single ORB score, a score out of 100 that rates your connection. 80 plus is solid, under 70, not so much. It's clean, ad-free, and a serious upgrade from your regular speed test app. If you're tired of random pings and notifications while gaming or reading on your phone, You've got to try this app that lets you set up app-specific do not disturb mode. Just allow the required permissions, enable it, add the apps you want to silence and enjoy your peace. It's lightweight, easy to use and effective. This handy app helps you access your favorite apps faster. You can pin them to widgets, a sidebar or even your notification panel for quick access. It's super simple easy to use and makes your phone feel more organized and efficient. Athena is like having a bodyguard for your Android phone. It blocks ads, trackers, digital fingerprinting and malware while giving you full control over which apps can access the internet. Just enable the firewall with a tap and block or restrict anything you want. Compared to other ad blockers that mainly block ads at the DNS level, Athena combines Parap firewall controls, deeper filtering and ad blocker all in one app with a clean material UI. Plus, it supports both VPN and root modes. So if you want privacy plus control in a single tool, you should check it out. And that's my list of the best Android apps to check out in 2025. If you found this video informative, like it, drop a comment below with your favorite app and subscribe for more best android apps videos thanks for watching and i'll catch you in the next one